guys, look how cute these are. Oh my god, get excited. <laughs> Hey guys, I'm Nicole Leno and this is Fast Forward Girls. Today I'm here in downtown LA to meet an amazing roboticist and dancer who's going to teach me how robots dance. This is Katie. She is a performer, choreographer, and technologist at Stanford University, and she's gonna teach me how I can incorporate robots into my dance routines. So how did you get into dancing with robots? I started using robots in all of my dance performances and art installations and traveling with them all over the world, and what I learned from that artistic work wound up becoming a huge part of my research. So honestly, like for, for me, whenever I think of a robot, like I see them in movies and they kind of seem scary. So I think every generation has Terminator or yeah, exactly. <laughs> Black Mirror, like yeah. their version of a very scary mm -hmm. robot. And really the robots that are made in real life are very different than the ones you see in the movies. How do you make robots more like friendly? It's not just what the robot looks like, but it's also how the robot moves. The whole idea is to bring principles from dance, choreography, movement, into some of these autonomously moving machines so that their movement feels more friendly, less scary. So what kind of dancing can robots do? When I think about what kind of dancing robots do, it's almost a style and a form that is not only unique to robotics in general, but like unique to that robot. All right, Nicole, are you ready to go dance with these robots? Yes, I am. <laughs> okay, let's do it. <laughs> is that the robot? This is the robot. Hey. Yeah, we're gonna jazz them up a little bit. <laughs> so we're gonna program some robots Yay. and make them move around. So this is a really small computer. It's very similar to probably your laptop or something that you've used at home. And it's a small computer, which means that we need to connect it to a big monitor and a keyboard and a mouse so we can program some commands onto it. What we're gonna do is choreograph a few patterns for the robots to do, and then we'll decide how we wanna dance with them. Basically what's gonna happen with this computer is we're gonna connect it over a router, um, which is the same kind of router that you have in your house. Mm -hmm. And that way we can send commands to it without having to plug in a bunch of cables. So where you kind of see those things lining Ooh. up. <laughs> <laughs> I know, wants to talk to you. <laughs> Words. All right. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Woo. Okay. Yeah. Coming at you. <laughs> Oh my god, that's so cool. <laughs> I'm ready to get some covers. <laughs> so we want to know which way is front. Okay. So the same way that we would want to make sure we're going forward instead of yeah. back, like we, this is going to help us keep track of where the robots are because ah. they don't have, yeah, they're circular. <laughs> they're really cute. <laughs> Now that we've got all of our robots dressed up and ready to go, we've got to figure out some stuff for them to do. I'm thinking that we could make some sketches about how we want them to move, and then we will put those commands into the computer. I think it would be cool if you went in the circle like this. I want to do like some arms. Okay. So I know like we can move right to mm -hmm. left, so we can do, go like side to side. They also spin, so right. we could do some like pirouettes or something. They could go out with your arms because you were sort of showing like right, right. and left, but also way from the body, yeah. right? So maybe they could spin in place. Like once they go out, they could be out here. All of our little Roombas going crazy. <laughs> you also said we could have them do side to side. So what if we put like four on each side? Yeah. And then they could go side to side oh, and, and it winds really cool. up cool. We've got these robots programmed. Now it's time for the challenge. Yay. Let's go. Okay.
robot did not make the cut. <laughs> <Okay>. See you. <laughs>